What in me is dark, a lumen, and what is low, rays and support, that to the height of this great argument I may assert eternal providence and justify the ways of God to men. Those are some of the beginning lines in Paradise Lost. This epic poem was first published in 1667 and it is considered to be the major work of John Milton. Paradise Lost concerns the biblical story of the fall of man and this full society edition contains a commentary by Alastair Fowler. The book is quarter bound in buckram with blocked duotone cloth sides. It has gilded page tops and 24 mesotins illustrated by John Martin. The book is printed on Abbey Woe paper, which you all are familiar with, probably. It's warm coloured, uh, slightly warm colour this one, uh, with a bit creaminess uh, to it, but otherwise a good quality, pH neutral, acid free paper. And the illustrations are printed on Serio Cal's Stucco paper, also a premium quality paper this one. Uh, the illustrations look great on it and it's very, very thick.
Hello, I hope you enjoyed this presentation of Paradise Lost. My future videos will, will look uh, different from this one. I will do more live recording, not only voiceover. And you will see that old warm lightning uh, lighting again in future videos. So um, I can get some really aesthetic shots of the books. Uh, this is what was mainly for uh, me testing my new setup and things. But uh, let's talk a bit about the commentary. The commentary for Paradise Lost comes with an introduction. It comes with textual notes. Uh, I'm sure it's um, I'm sure it's good good content. I haven't really read Paradise Lost. I haven't read it, I should say, and I don't plan to read the book for a while. I of course want to read uh, the Bible first, but uh, Paradise Lost from the Fuller Society is very oversized. So that's the real real problem when you have a commentary that is the same size as, as the book it takes up a lot of space when you want to read them together so that can be uh, a difficulty and it can be quite annoying i would imagine um, so it might not be the best reading edition that you can get but it's still a fantastic edi edition especially when you get the oversized illustrations um, but it doesn't really benefit from having it oversized otherwise with the commentary. It's mainly a collector's book, I would say. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, as I said. Things will look different in the future. But um, yeah, I think, I think I will figure stuff out that will make my videos better. Uh, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.